And here's another development-related story. In August, the firm that will be overseeing the redevelopment of Union Square kicked off what it calls 100 Days of Engagement. News Director Jane Regan was there. Neighbors, officials, and business people turned out on August 19th to sample food inspired by Union Square's diverse cultures, to listen to a local band, to check out a drone, and to write down their visions for what the new Union Square should look like. The 100 Days is really aimed at three main, main points. The first is to continue the engagement that we've done in the community, in the area, to, to hear your feedback and include uh, all your individual perspectives in the vision for the community. The second really is to define a master uh, urban planning process together. Uh, we'll work with the city and the, the CAC to do that. Um, that will we'll really guide our, our work going forward. Uh, and the last is really to lay the foundation for um, the urban planning process. Greg Karcheski said there are many key issues that need to be discussed with the community. Housing, job creation, um, uh, the, you know, I independent retailers, sustainability, all the issues that are important to the development is about the trade-offs required. And you know, there, there's a, a, a tremendous opportunity here to, to address a lot of those needs and we just need to work with the community to kind of figure out what's most important and where the highest priorities are. US2 will be signing a community benefits agreement. And we're in support of the, the, the concept of a community benefits agreement and look forward to working with the, the, the CAC and the city to, to craft that as part of the broader plan that's being constructed. Crafting the agreement will take some time. Today's the first launch of a very long and fruitful and successful relationship and collaboration with the city, the community, and our partner. The mayor pointed out that all parties will need to understand the value of the community we want all of us to invest in, whether it be investment in small, local, independently run and operated businesses, the diversity of this community, the creativity, the originality, making sure that everybody has a place here if they want to live here, work here, play here. Neighbors, business people, and elected officials turned out for the launch of US2's 100 Days of Engagement. They promise meetings, fora, and opportunities for folks to give their input. We'll be following during the next 100 days. For Somerville Neighborhood News, I'm Jane Regan.